I want to introduce a flexible oscilloscope positioner for both horizontal and vertical probing today. The Flex Positioner TP100 has a strong base weighs about 5 pounds to provide a stable probing in most cases. However, if you need a more steady probe setup, the positioner base has a strong magnet to firmly attach a steel plate on your bench. This positioner can hold all oscilloscope probes in the market such as Agilent, LaCroix, and Tektronix high-speed probes. This positioner provides a steady probing force to the PCB for high-speed signal probing, eye diagrams, or jitter measurements. The positioner has three sets of knobs. The main big knob is for course adjustment. You can place the probe in the right direction by tightening the big knob. Notice that you only need a single knob to tighten all four loose arms at the same time. The second set of fine-tuning knobs can move the probe in X, Y, or Z directions in a very small increments. The third knob is located close to the probe holder. You can swing the probe sideways such that both signal and ground tips are on the same plane. This setup demonstrates horizontal probing including a 2 megapixel pen microscope and a flex positioner. Camera image is displayed on the screen. After the probe is attached to the positioner in the clamp, tighten the probe holder screw at the bottom. Loosen the big knob to orient the probe tips closer to the probing position. Adjust the theta knob close to the tip of the probe holder such that the signal ground pins are on the same plane. Finally, use the fine X, Y, or Z adjustment knobs to place the probe tips at the right location. The next flex positioner demo is for vertical probing of DDR DIMM module in a computer chassis. This setup includes a pen microscope and a flex positioner which sit on top of several magnetic bricks. Use the right number of magnetic bricks to adjust the height of flex positioner base. Adjust the big knob to position the probe tips to the DDR DIMM module. Use the pen microscope to identify the probing pads on the back side of the DIMM module. Adjust the X, Y, or Z fine adjustments to ensure the probe tips firmly contact to the PCB pads.